Welcome to Breezer. Okay, why am I looking at one of my old videos from like last year and literally it looks better than the setup that I have now? There's a lot of stuff. I, I just want my room to be nice. You're gonna get the curls that I've been waiting to see for a long time. Like I don't have the curls that I have in this video because that was quarantine length and I absolutely loved every moment of that. Let's go to the bathroom. Let's just, let's just, let's go in the bathroom. We're not gonna, we got that. It's not everything I want. It's beautiful. Oh yeah, we first we have to fix everything up out here, like I said, but we're redoing my room yet again. Well, this is the first time we're actually gonna see it. I've mentioned myself talking about redoing my room, but I never actually recorded it before. I just do it. It's time to make myself look beautiful. Whoa, handsome. Cause handsome is for boys. <laughs> How are you doing today? But hey, what's up? So um, I'm in my room getting ready for the moving process. I, I, I'll, I'll give you a quick, um, like not a B-roll, but a tour kind of a what my room looks like right now. It's uh, kind of, it's not dirty, but I'm out of breath. <sighs> Woo, I'm okay. I'm just very excited today. Very ecstatic. Um, uh, ah, okay. Oh, yeah. My room. Let's let's do that. Okay, pause. Let's read through. So in all actuality, the only problem that presents itself is what is my room going to look like? What 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 am I moving around? Because I have all this stuff, and I've moved my room around so many times, different places, like not different places, but different styles and stuff. I'm like, okay, what can I do that I haven't done before? Or at least, how can I make it look nice? Don't know what I'm gonna do. You're getting the video, so we're doing something. We're moving stuff around. And it's hot, so I'm probably gonna take off this shirt and... Nice. Did you actually think we were listening to that? Psych! see the whole room is basically empty except for the the tripod the lamp stand there my uh my dresser my bed and my whatever that's called my desk area you know i was thinking about taking this part of the desk completely off because i think it's awkward and i just don't like it anymore i want to just have this space on here but the only problem that presents itself is that you know, I don't have a place to store it, so I would have to throw it away. And that's not something entirely that I want to do right now because I could change my mind to like, you know what? This is actually pretty a pretty good thing. Why I throw it away? Yikes, that's a gonna be a big problem. But that sounds like a problem for future Reed's room, future Andrew. So I might just take it to the dump. So for the longest time, I did not realize that my thing here was screwed on. Like, look at this thing. It's, it screws. I can take that off easy. I thought I had to break it or something, but I have my screw, my, my, my toolbox in my, in my, um, my, what's it called? My closet. And I'll take it out and put, take the screws out and see what it looks like without it. And I'll figure out what to do with it afterwards. Like I said, that's a problem for future Andrew. You can't see me very well, but it's coming together. At least I think it looks pretty nice. Um, the bed, I mean, it's it's a bed. I have a weird kind of bed. I have I have two beds in one. Wow! It's weird. It's kind of cool, but yikes! It's it's perfect for sleepovers, but 
Nobody sleeps over my house. And all the times that other people did come to my house and ended up sleeping in my room, they took my bed and I had to sleep elsewhere in, in my lovely, my lovely house. You better stop! Uh, you know. <laughs> yeah. So we're getting everything together. I, I realized that I'm not gonna be able to put it exactly where I wanted it to, but uh, I texted Avery, I told him that, um, to get some command strips since he's out and I'm going to continue moving everything in my room. So let's keep, uh, keep it going. Obviously, the mirror cannot stay there. So, wow, my room actually sounds pretty open, open, open. Oh, okay, that was kind of wild. But yeah, the, the, this mirror cannot stay there like that because the bed is in front of it and it just looks disgusting like that. So what I'm gonna, what I'm thinking about is putting it horizontally on that wall. And every time I look, it's like, whoa, it's an infinite mirror. But see, like, see, there's no mirror right there. There's a mirror there. I really put it horizontally, but I need more command strips because I don't know if I put the command strips that are already on the wall over here on that section. I don't know if they'll stick to the wall the way I want them to. And if I put them on there and they don't stick, well, they stick for the first like five seconds. And then when I leave the room and hear a crash, I have no more mirror and I have no money to buy another mirror. Fine. So yeah, we're, uh, the room is coming along pretty nicely. You know, I can kind of, I'm not gonna start putting things back together in here yet because I still have some other things I'm working on and other things I have to talk about with my parents. You know what that means. Let's go. So, nails, the, the, on the back of the mirror, there are things for hooks. There are hooks on there, so for, for nails, but yeah, oh, so not too, Sure, I'm putting holes in the walls again, so I'm just going to either um, uh, wait for those command strips. A few moments later. I didn't wait for the command strips, but the problem could present itself where it falls at any moment. So, um, don't know what to do. Let's be very careful in here. Well, you were with me for the whole day, the whole freaking day, and it's. I'm happy to say that it was a good one because I finished the room. It looks, I think it looks pretty good, especially this mirror right here specifically. This is what makes the room the room. And I mean, when you look over here, it's like an empty wall, but then you look over here, bam, huge mirror. Like, isn't, that's just like, oh my goodness, bro. It's, it's so, amazing and i'm loving every single bit of it and my whole my whole new setup over here i love it so i'm gonna i'm actually gonna do my outro sitting down in three two one that was today's video i'm taking the glasses off because the ring light's causing glare love when that happens um thank you for watching today's video it was super fun making and it was just very not enlightening but what's the word um um, the inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Um, I just wanted to thank you for watching today because you didn't have to watch my video, but you did. So appreciate it, appreciate it. Now it's time for me to go because I actually have homework to do that I neglected to do today because I was doing this all day. Well, um... <laughs>
If you like the video, you should press the like button. If you, if you subscribe to the channel, I'd be very happy about that. I can't give you anything, but the thing I can give you is more content, which is something that you would look for since you subscribe to the channel because there'd be more and more videos like this for you to see. And if you have not turned on the notification bell, you should totally do that. Do all those three things for me. And you know, watch all my other videos because I have like more than a hundred. But um, yeah, that's that 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 that's about it. And uh, without further ado, I'm gonna put my hand to the camera like the, like the, the lens like I usually do in my videos. I'm rambling because I don't know what to say now. It's a defense mechanism. I'm gonna go. Bye bye. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful Friday. Jesus loves you, and I love you too.